Now, if you live or work around Jackson, you are now required to wear a face mask in settings where you cannot always maintain social distancing. 12 News' Alex Love traveled around Jackson seeing just how serious people were taking this order. Jackson businesses and city parks are back up and running as people try to get back to some sort of normalcy, but under a lot of circumstances, if you go out in public, you may be required to wear some sort of face covering. Everybody should not be able to go in unless they have a mask on. I think it should be mandatory. Next time you go out grocery shopping or in major department stores, your mouth and nose area will have to be covered, and already shoppers aren't taking any risk. I take care of two of my grandchildren. So, you know, that's been a little difficult, but we're okay with that. My mom's in a retirement community, so every day's a new challenge. It's just like smoke, dear. You don't want to get anything in your lungs. So I try to stay healthy for an old man. <laughs> Specifically under the Safer at Home order, any individual who is over the age of two and able to medically or physically tolerate a face covering shall be required to cover their nose and mouth when in public places, unable to maintain six foot social distance. It's any place to where you would come into contact with other people and it would be within the six feet. Of course, if you're in your own garden and you're working and you're by yourself, of course, there would be no need to wear a face mask. Under CDC guidelines, cloth face coverage works the best, slowing the spread of the virus by preventing those who may have it and not know it from spreading the droplets through the air when coughing or sneezing. It seems like the virus, it's not that many people catching it since they started the social distancing and wearing these face masks. It, 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 it's, it's not every day where you got some staggering figures. At all strip malls we visited off I-55 showed majority of shoppers were wearing their face masks while going inside. Meanwhile, at Parham Bridges Park, several groups within a foot of each other had no face coverage, including this big group of tennis players gathered on the same court. This order will be in effect for at least two weeks. If you have any physical or medical problems from wearing a mask, there are some exceptions. You can find out what those are by heading over to our website, WJTV.com. Reporting in Jackson, Alex Love, 12 News.